if you know my channel then you know it and I'm a huge fan of Samsung Galaxy A54 and when I compare the camera with Samsung Galaxy S23 I was so impressed with this uh, little device I mean not a little it's actually bigger than S23 uh, but comparing with the Pixel 8 I can see how much wider the field of view is on the Pixel which I really like here on Samsung I am a bit cropped in which is just okay for, for vlogging uh, you're definitely gonna be happy about the Pixel 8 but I'm gonna take some selfies now there's horrible weather here in the UK but I can't help it can I Uh, this is ultra wide angle 4k 30 fps on both however pixel is capable of shooting 4k 60 fps across all the lenses including selfie which is pretty impressive and it's not fair comparison really because you know pixel 8 is twice as expensive but because a54 is such a capable device i thought i'll do a little comparison just to show you guys how good the mid-range phones are well, let's carry on with the stabilization and move on to the main sensor now. Still 4K and I think stabilization is pretty nice. However, Pixel 8 is just a little bit better in my opinion. Moving on to times two. It's 1080p 60 FPS on Samsung Galaxy A54 and 4K 60 FPS on Pixel. Uh, you let me know which stabilization is actually better. By the way, if you are enjoying my content, do me a huge favor and subscribe to my channel because I purchase all these phones for my own money. Cheers. main sensor 30 fps on pixel to get that speech enhancement mode so you should uh, be able to feel the difference in audio quality however on the other side i'm using steady mode for those steady shots however it's only 1080p by the way which phone you actually prefer so far the picture is looking pretty nice on both to be honest Okay guys, but well let's check on load light conditions. I always try to use the tripod in the darkest scenarios and I put it on the tripod so you can avoid our shakiness. And you can tell the Pixel uses six seconds long exposure, but Pixel only uses two to three. Uh, but let's go and check on results. video quality at night as you can see it's pretty dark here but as soon as we switch to the main sensor then we can clearly see the difference and I have to say they both doing a really good job here uh, but let's move on two times two what do you think so far I think pixel is doing a little bit better here but let's move on to selfie camera now selfie camera it is extremely dark here i am standing by the light but if i go a little bit further away 
it's, you know, you cannot see much really. So, well, I'm gonna take some selfies now. I have to say guys, I'm a huge fan of this 60 FPS 4K across all the lenses on Pixel 8. However, $699, is just way too expensive in my opinion you know picture um, pictures at night looking very similar portrait photography is a little bit better on pixel stabilization is pretty much the same yes you got that speech enhancement so audio is just a little bit better you know I love that dynamic range but for the price this Samsung Galaxy A54 is a way better value for money you can buy this for around 350 or even um, refurbished for about 280 come on for this price this is no-brainer you still got that expandable storage lovely picture quality decent stabilization only one thing that was better uh, it's a portrait photography other than that yes you got more performance on pixel but for day to day I would not have any complaints I was actually using this phone myself for the last three months did my uh, video editing in 4k and this phone did just fine but you let me know your thoughts if you want to save you some money I would highly recommend get a pixel 7 I'll put the video up here and I'll catch you guys in the next one cheers <laughs>